Essentially, we all fall into one of two mindsets. Basically, the whole premise of this book, Black Box Thinking by Matthew Sider, is that when we fail, we basically fall into a growth mindset or a fixed mindset. So let's start with a fixed mindset. A fixed mindset is when you fail at something and you try and shift the blame onto, onto somebody else or onto external circumstance. So let's think of an example. For example, if you fail a test and instead of accepting that you didn't have the, the right skills or the right knowledge, you, you try and shift the blame onto the fact that you didn't get a good night's sleep last night or that the test was just ridiculously hard. Um, so basically this is a very limiting mindset because you're not able to search inside and try and find areas in which you can actually improve and you can influence instead of blaming external influences that you have no control over. But if we can switch our mindset to a growth mindset, which is what the book is basically all about, then we can actually search inside and find the areas in which we can improve upon. So let's, for example, say that your business failed. Now, somebody might say my business failed because the, the financial economy is, is rubbish. But that is essentially a fixed mindset because you're not searching inside and thinking, okay, the economy's bad, so how can I search for areas in which I can improve my business, I can improve myself, I can improve the way I operate. How can I search for areas in which I can improve and prevent failure in the future? So somebody might say, okay, I failed because my marketing was whack. Like, but I, didn't, I didn't engage with the right audience. I didn't do enough research. I didn't hire a, a marketing company to do work for me. Um, so the reason that they failed, they, they can identify that. And then next time, when they, the next time around with their business, um, even if the economy is bad, then they still, they're able to improve upon where they, they failed last time. And that's very much the premise of a growth mindset. And if you can do that in business, if you can do that in life, if you, wherever, you, wherever you pursue, if you can actually fail well, because we're all going to fail, it's inevitable, like, nobody's perfect, we're all going to we're all going to fuck up at some point. So if, if we can actually search for the areas in which we can improve in the future, then you're going to be really successful. And that's, that's all about having a growth mindset and, and not blaming other people or other circumstances, but searching inside yourself and embracing failure.